Kim Min Waters incursion CCP launches propaganda blitz as families of deceased fishermen demand justice. Intro, welcome to Capture the Intelligence. Today we are analyzing the recent escalation of tensions between Taiwan and China following a CCP fastboat incident in Kim Min Waters. On February 2024, a Chinese Communist Party CCP fastboat carrying four individuals entered the waters of Kim Min, an island controlled by Taiwan. The Taiwanese Coast Guard intercepted the vessel and during the confrontation, it capsized, resulting in the deaths of two people. The CCP has condemned the incident, claiming it was a fishing vessel operating on traditional fishing grounds. However, Taiwan's Coast Guard maintains the boat was engaged in illegal activities and refused to stop for inspection. This incident is the latest in a series of provocations by the CCP against Taiwan. In recent months, the CCP has increased its military presence around Taiwan and intensified its rhetoric about the need to reunify the island with the mainland. Experts believe the CCP's incursion into Kimmins waters was a deliberate attempt to intimidate Taiwan and test the resolve of the United United States and its allies. The CCP is employing various tactics, including military intimidation, economic coercion, and political subversion to pressure Taiwan into accepting its demands. The CCP is also using the fishing boat incident as a pretext to further escalate tensions with Taiwan. Experts highlight the CCP's history of using similar incidents to justify military action against its neighbors. Analysis The CCP these actions in the Kim Min fishing boat incident are deeply concerning. The CCP is using this incident to create public opinion, create tension, intimidate Taiwan, test the response of the United States and its allies, and create excuses for future actions. The CCP's strategy is clear. It wants to intimidate Taiwan into submission and deter the United States and its allies from coming to Taiwan's aid in the event of a conflict. The CCP the CCP is also using this incident to test the Biden administration's resolve and to gauge the level of support for Taiwan among the American people and America's allies. The CCP's actions are a serious threat to peace and stability in the Taiwan Strait and the wider Indo-Pacific region. If the CCP is not stopped, it could lead to a military conflict that would have devastating consequences for Taiwan, China, and the entire world. What can be done. There are a number of things that the United States and its allies can do to deter the CCP and prevent a conflict over Taiwan. These include e. maintaining a strong military presence in the Indo-Pacific region or providing Taiwan with the it needs to defend itself and strengthening economic ties with Taiwan. C. Supporting Taiwan's participation in international organizations. Wu. Speaking out against the CCP's aggression and human rights abuses. The United States and its allies must also work together to develop a comprehensive strategy for dealing with the CCP's growing assertiveness. This strategy should include both diplomatic and military elements. Conclusion The CCP's fast boat incursion into Kim Min Waters is a serious threat to peace and stability in the Taiwan Strait and the wider Indo-Pacific region. The United States and its allies must take steps to deter the CCP and prevent a conflict over Taiwan. If you found this video insightful, be sure to like, share, and smash that subscribe button. Stay tuned for the latest current affairs on the Capture the Intelligence channel.